This is a pretty unique operation. One of a kind, really. It's not something that will happen every day. It's a very special project. We've got a strong HSE team working in conjunction with the operation team. Installing uh, close to 830 tons of steel. This work is essential to get us going into the Black Sea and finally start drilling on the Neptune deep field. Neptune Deep Project is a fantastic project. Uh, we are thrilled to deliver this project you know, for our customer in the Black Sea. Uh, it's a game changer for Romania and uh, you know, uh, Transocean Barents is very excited to be part of this uh, project. Uh, we're on the Transocean Barents and it's docked in Spain and Cartagena, shipyard. The purpose for uh, our being here is to lower the REM guide uh, to enable the rig to pass uh, underneath the bridges through the Bosporus into the Black Sea. Transocean's role for Project Neptune is providing the customer with a rig that was able to, in a timely manner, make it into the Black Sea, get back operational, and then be able to go drilling. To do that, we have to fold the derrick down, basically to allow for a clearance of about six meters under the bridges in the Bosporus state in Turkey. Uh, the first step in, in preparing the rig for lowering the mast was to remove the drilling equipment on, from the drill floor, clear the mast from uh, hydraulic lines, uh, cables. Uh, it has been an operation that we have been working towards and waiting for for months now. Uh, a lot of manpower is involved in doing this safely and in a controlled manner. Yeah, huge, huge project. Uh, towers, bracings, all sorts of steel work. The construction work to build foundations uh, that are necessary to do the folding work. Installing uh, close to 830 tons of steel. Uh, there's going to be strand jacks that will be connected onto the derrick. The derrick is going to be hinged, so it's going to come down, cantilever type thing. Strengthening decks, strengthening structures, existing structures, avoid distortion of the ram guide when it's lowered. The towers to be installed where the ram guide or the derrick to be folded down and rested. Lowering the mast is a complex operation. You have eight strain checks that uh, are having to produce a, a controlled maneuver to lower the ram guide uh, to get us ready uh, and get the heights right so we can pass underneath the bridges of the Bosporus. I love all this type of stuff, you know what I mean? And this is a one-off, uh, probably in uh, my career, but I'm going to see something going on like this. Uh, the derrick itself weighs roughly around 250 tons, but the, the equipment that we're, we've installed to do the folding is two 500 ton strain jacks, so it's more than uh, capable. From my point of uh, perspective, it's the captain of the Barents. It's, it's uh, of course exciting to, to, to see how the engineering has taken in place. To, uh, for us to be able to pass the bridges in the in the Bosporus Strait. So the team has done a fantastic job. It's been a long stretch, you know, it's probably 36 to 48 hours with day and night shift and ensuring continuity. Um, it's a lot of focus, a lot of attention uh, by all parties to make sure that we do it safely. The process of actually splitting and making the derrick foldable has taken a little over two and a half months. We'll get it ready for uh, sea fastening, we'll get it ready to travel and make the transit for under the bridge. Everybody in, in Petrum is excited to see the rig coming and uh, finally get us kicked off on the field development. Developing the Neptune deep gas fields is a key milestone for Romania and Europe. Feeling absolutely stoked that the rig is getting underway and coming to us and we are more than ready to receive it in Romania and uh, finally get going and drill those wells.